cry out And without Christ abiding in you, without you abiding in Christ, you will never be fit to tackle on the life you are facing to live. John prepared the way of the Lord. The Lord prepared a way for you and I. Came down to earth, born of a Virgin Mary, stepped on to the front line of the battlefield. He was spat on, mocked at, beaten and crucified. He died, was buried, and rose with all power in his hands. He walked through the fire here on earth. Can somebody say Shaq, Rack, Shaq, and Betty? He conquered death, and I can see him turning around and looking at me saying, Now follow me. Am I fit for this? In Christ I am, outside of Christ I am not. We need to get in where we fit in. We fit in Christ. So again, I ask you, are you fit? See, when God is our primary reason for our fellowship, church, it shouldn't matter how the food tastes. Amen, somebody. It, 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 it shouldn't matter who gets the credit for cooking the chicken. Amen, somebody. It, when God is our primary reason for fellowship, regardless of the food, we should be excited, amen, somebody, about God and his fellowship. First Corinthians 1 and 9. Out. See, from my house to your house, I want to encourage the saints to let the church keep praising God. Amen, somebody. Verse number 47. The church was praising God and having favor with all the people. And it was the Lord's church that added to the church daily, such as should be saved. It was the obedient, loving, faithful behavior and integrity of the church. Bye. Uh -huh. 